So I just got back to Kaya Coco and it's been raining. It's about, what is it? Midnight? One o'clock? And it is flooded. This is all underwater. And this is, you can't really see. This is gonna be interesting. All right, see you inside. This is my nighttime routine. Come in one o'clock, get my day sack, chocolate, water, water. This is just like a game of like what's in my bag. What else is in my bag? Speaker, charger, moniker, pack of cards. It's great. All vitals. Vitals. God, the tropical storm is really setting in now. It's raining pretty much every night. Um, I haven't really explained where I am or what I'm doing here, actually. Um, this is like a rooftop above a bar. Um, I'll show you to it in the daytime. Alright, so this is like the bar that I got introduced to through a friend that was working at the hostel. <coughs> I was working for like the first three, four days um, hard on this place to make it like turn it around, turn it into like some sort of business. Uh, it was good fun. Oh yeah, in even crazier hair than now. First job today, fix the fence. I fixed it before, but it blew down in the storm. It's really difficult to dig holes here. So I'm gonna do that. Anyway, the guy who um, was renting basically was finding it difficult to try and get money into the country, so he couldn't pay rent. So now I'm just kind of like, well, I got kicked out for a while, um, and then stayed at Garden Village again, worked for a motorbike company down the road, <coughs> helping them clean stuff out, and then I kept moved back in here. I spent two nights in here, this is my second night, third night, something like that. I think overall with all of the stuff that's going on here, it's difficult to talk about because obviously it's still very ongoing and um, it's quite personal matters as well. And it's difficult to make videos at the moment because I can't really put things in. I can't really stress enough how much of a like tip this place was before I arrived, but uh, I managed to find these tools just around and... Uh, where everything had been chucked, basically. The previous owner had just told all the um, people who were here, it was more of a, like a chill out zone, just to take whatever they wanted. Um, so they did. <laughs> anyway, dig this hole, fence back, make this stuff look better. I don't know my next task. Maybe garden, that's the next big task, but I'll, um, I'll update you that, update you with that when I know. <coughs> I really like this place. Um, I took it over from a guy called Callum. Who uh, was working here for about a month before me. So right now I am picking up lots of different things to do a sacrifice or a offering to a temple so that my friend Callum can get a tattoo. Seven types of fruit, ten lotus, flower, one pack of incense, and five candles. There you go. Do you want to show you the tattoo? Yeah. Now you get beaten up. Anyways, to wrap up tonight, basically 
yeah, that's why I'm staying now. Nice little rooftop. Stayed here a couple of nights now. Um, almost a week, I think. Yeah, it's a nice place. Um, just chilling at Garden Village in the day, going about general things. Just meeting up with lots of cool people, basically. I like slowing down now and again when traveling. Like, I travel very slowly, but when you spend like a long time in one place, then you just see so many people come through and you get that sort of like longer term um, friendship, which is nice. So anyway, I'm going to wrap up for tonight, but I'll see you next time I get out of my phone. I'm going to try and maybe... Mm, okay. This was like a plan I was thinking about. I was like, maybe I can film a little bit every day or when something happens and then do like a longer video every now and then. We'll see how this goes.